Hi boys and girls, today I'm inside my classroom for right now and I want to read you Pig the Pug by Erin Blabby. Pig was a pug and I'm sorry to say he was greedy and selfish in almost every way. He lived in a house with a wiener dog, Trevor, but when was he nice to him? I'll tell you never. You've got some great toys there, poor Trevor would say, but Pig would just grumble, they're mine, go away. But it might be more fun, Trevor said to Pig, if we both played together. Well, Pig flipped his wig. No, they are mine, didn't you hear? Only mine. You keep your paws off them. They are mine, mine, mine. I know what your game is. I know you want me to share, but I'll never do that. I won't, and I swear. Hmm. Doesn't seem too nice. And with that, he proceeded to gather his stuff and make a big pile with a huff and a puff. And once he had gathered them up in a pile, he howled from the top with a satisfied smile. There, shouted Pig, now you won't get my loot. It's mine, 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 mine. So why don't you scoot? But just at that moment, poor Trevor did see the pile was wobbling. Oh dear me. Watch out over there, good Trevor did cry. But the shame of it was... Well, pugs cannot lie. Just fell out that window. These days it's different, I'm happy to say. It's so very different in almost every way. Yes, Pig shares his toys now and Trevor's his friend. They both play together. While pigs on the mend. So at the end of the story, Pig learned that it was nice to share. I hope you enjoyed this and see you soon.